Thanks for tuning into the Clapper Report. I'm Aaron Clapper with Shorewood Realtors. Linda Hernandez is our buyer's agent here on the team. Linda works exclusively with all the buyers that we work with. So Linda, what's important about choosing a buyer's agent? So having worked with so many buyers, um, I've developed a skill set where it allows me to really understand what the buyers are looking for early on. So whether it's buying a single family that they're going to live in or an income property, I really understand what it is they're trying to accomplish, uh, what kind of lifestyle they want, and partner up with them in accomplishing that goal. So what makes you different than other buyers agents or other agents that are working with buyers here in our marketplace? So in this market, we have one whole market and then we have mini markets. So I'm able to walk into any mini market and quickly understand it. Sometimes we forget how important it is to understand what's important to the sellers. So whenever we're presenting an offer, we, I always get a background on why the seller is selling, what they need, what they're trying to accomplish. So when we write our offer, it is uh, something that stands out. Recently we had clients that were looking in a really small marketplace, lots of competition. There were 24 offers and our offer got accepted $10,000 less than the highest offer, simply because the seller really felt that we wanted to give her what she wanted. Great. So in, in working with a buyer, you're looking to get them the property for as little money as possible. And mm -hmm. by understanding the terms that the seller is looking for, you're able to accomplish that. Absolutely. So for the buyers out there, what should they know about being the buyer? about how they can effectively help you get an offer accepted. So being committed to this process is really important. Looking at these homes in the first two to three days is very important because if you assume they're going to be there next week, chances are they're not. So if you're casually looking here and there, the chances are that you are not going to purchase the property. So everyone's hearing a lot about off-market opportunities, off-market listings. Can you explain how you're able to give our buyers an edge when searching for and purchasing these off-market uh, properties. So right now, more than ever, we're seeing properties that are selling off-market, never hitting the MLS. So as a team, we were able to sell three in the last two weeks, and that's with heavy networking. We do a lot of prospecting ourselves, but we also network with the agents in the area. So those opportunities come to really only a slim few, and we're able to to uh, bring that to our clients. What advice do you have for buyers after you sell them a home? Maintaining the home is critical. Uh, we've seen homes that have been really well maintained or in an original condition, selling for almost as much as homes that have been remodeled. Because when you walk into a home, you can really feel whether it's been maintained. And if there's areas that haven't been maintained, it's very obvious. I would also budget in every couple years um, some kind of upgrade, whether it be a furnace, a roof, flooring, kitchen, things like that. And, and why is that important? It's really hard to get a house that's been neglected to feel fresh again. If you're looking at a buyer's, from a buyer's perspective, if there have been certain things that have been neglected, they're wondering what else has been neglected. And that's going to translate into the offer that they're going to make. So for buyers out there that want to have an amazing experience in working with you as a buyer's agent, how can they reach you, Linda? So I can be reached via email, text, or phone. My phone number is 310-977-9597 or lynda at clappergroup.com. So this month, the stat that we're going to look at is how many months supply of inventory we have. Remember that less than a one month supply of homes means a very strong seller's market. More than the three month supply of homes means a very strong buyer's market. So let's start with Manhattan Beach. Currently there are 63 active homes for sale in Manhattan Beach. Now we're looking at condos, townhomes, and single family residences. In the past 30 days, 35 have actually sold, which means there's a 1.8 month supply of homes for sale currently in Manhattan Beach. In Hermosa Beach, 39 homes are actively for sale and in the past 30 days, 15 have actually sold. A 2.6 month supply of homes currently on the market. In Redondo Beach, there are 118 homes currently for sale and 100 have sold in the past 30 days a 1.2 month supply of homes. Obviously, Redondo is really strong right now as a seller's market. In Torrance, there are currently 126 homes for sale and 116 have sold in the past 30 days. Only a 1.1 month supply. Also a very strong seller's market. In Rancho Palos Verdes, 112 homes are currently for sale and 48 have sold in the past 30 days. That's a 2.3 month supply of homes for sale. In Palos Verdes Estates, 
There's 53 homes that are actively for sale and 17 have closed in the past 30 days. That's a 3.1 month supply of homes. So as you can see, the market might be a little slower in PV estates, but still very, very active. In Rolling Hills, there are 15 homes actively for sale and only three have sold in the past 30 days. That's a five month supply of homes available today. And in Rolling Hills Estates, there's 26 homes that are actively for sale and nine have sold in the past 30 days, a 2.9 month supply of homes. Now, in looking at these numbers, one thing to remember is that pricing is, is so very important. So do you have to assume that your property is gonna take 1.1 months, 1.2 months, 3.1 months, five months to sell? Absolutely not. If you choose a great agent and you price it right, market it well, and make it show its very, very best, the property will sell ahead of its competition every single time. So thanks so much for tuning into the Clapper Report. If there's any specific questions you have about your property, your neighborhood, or just real estate in general, you can reach me. My name is Aaron Clapper, Shorewood Realtors. I'm at 310-546-9800 or aaron at clappergroup.com.